Hello, everybody, and welcome. It is time. Final Fantasy VII Remake is here, and it is time to get back to Tifa. Always a wonderful time. Uh, Jeremy Thompson, thank you for gifting two subs to the community. Happy anniversary to uh, Reno Valentine and Flying Eagles, courtesy of a very generous Jeremy Thompson 529. Press any button to continue. Uh, anytime I hear that, it just takes me back to my childhood. Like, every time you crack open a new Final Fantasy game. I didn't beat a Final Fantasy game until 10. But since then, I've beaten a few. Uh, bonus item eligible save data. Sure, check. Claim your Leviathan summoning materia. Hell yeah. Rama summoning. Hell yeah. I got these things. We'll go with default. Wireless controller speaker settings. Off. Yeah, I, I, I like it when sounds come through here. Difficulty? We'll go with normal. Combat style. Active. See your home. See my home screen? Why do you see my home screen? Oh, fucking hell. Fucking... I hate this capture card so fucking much, mate. There. I, I can't find a good one to save my fucking life. Thank you for bringing that up, Ezzy. Thank you for the 69 months. Nice. All right, the Miura bullshit where we've already fought Sephiroth. I'm waiting, Cloud. Claudio. I'm here on the Midgar Expressway. The scene is indescribable. Hello, Alucard. Countless buildings have been leveled, and part of the road has collapsed. The smoke rising from the rubble is reminiscent of a funeral pyre. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... I the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction caused by a massive tornado which swept through Sector 0, 1, and 2. Yeah, climate disasters are nutty. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, Mayor Domino released a statement declaring the tornado to be, quote, weather warfare. Weather warfare. In search of group known as Avalanche. They control the weather! The administration also suspects the involvement of Wu Tai and has begun investigations into the matter. Ah, propaganda. Conrad the Blue, thank you for the seven months. Happy anniversary to you. Ooh, an Avatar the Last Airbender bento bar inspired by the elements. Interesting. Like, in, like a drink that you have to incorporate all four elements into. I think that could be kind of cool. I think I know how I'd do it, too. It's a feather. Got a smudge on my screen. Oh, hey, Zach. This is only the most recent in a series of crises. 
multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the hit. <sighs> The fall of the Sector 7 Boy, that tornado really did a number on the city. So this takes place after? Which must have been caused by the tornado. Oh, hey, what up, girl? When it rains, it pours. As you can see. Oh, over there. Amidst Fucking the Miura weird-ass bullshit already happening. Operations are already in progress. We still have one soldier right. That soldier, armed with a buster sword, highly dangerous. I repeat, the fugitive is an ex-soldier, armed with a buster sword. Uh-oh. Uh Back over here! Get him on board! Prep for takeoff! The rescue team has pulled people from the rubble! Quick! Uh, get the camera off him! Come on! This way! Contact the SAR team! Targets have been secured! We are exfilling via helo now! Move it! We're taking Keep off! Keep the puppy safe! What? Hey! Turn that off! The, the survivors are being taken away! I got it! I got it! Oh no, I got a way to kill you! Not very media friendly, I take it. Anime grunts. Excuse me. Could you look after my friend? Just for a bit. Too much Mako. But he'll be fine. <laughs> hey! GTG. Okay, so is this an alternate timeline? Aerith! It's dog time! Not the safest, Red. Arctic, thank you for the 19 months. Happy land anniversary to you. Welcome. Okay, well, I guess we're Zach now. I don't care about your boundaries. Get hey guys, what's up? He's got a buster sword. Hey, you see that guy? What you want? Yeah, don't shoot him from the helicopter. Go down and meet him with your guns. Oh, you're going fucked up now. Damn, man, Zach can lift. I mean, yeah, he's swinging around that hunk of metal, but... How'd the last game end? Not like this. The last thing I remember them doing was hitchhiking. Good dog. Where's the agent? Heads are gonna roll if we don't find her. Just shut the hell up and search. This is 
so messed up. All of it. But I'm back now, Aerith. I'm back. Meanwhile, in the other timeline. All right, then. Yep. Seeing as we've got the time, want to tell the rest of us about you and your buddy Sephiroth? Sure. If Tifa doesn't mind. Me? Yeah, no problem. It's cool. It all started five years ago. I was 16 at the time. There was hardly any work for soldiers back then. And the little there was, it was boring as hell. My heart wasn't in it. Then, out of nowhere, the job of a lifetime came. A mission with Sephiroth. The Sephiroth. Seph dog. I my luck. Seph dog, please don't go. Come back here. Cloud needs you. Sephiroth. It's really coming down, huh? Hey man, feeling any better? I'm good. Yeah, that's the one sure with blonde hair. Me. Wish I could help, but never been motion sick. Sorry, man. Haha, <laughs> the irony. Ready to do this? Yeah, you bet. Soldier squat! Soldier squat! <laughs> hey, rein it in. Sorry. No can do. Kids. Say, I'd like to be briefed on the mission at some point. Not necessary. If it's another one of those Turks gigs, you can let me off right here. Really? Finally make first, and what do they do? Call a ceasefire with Wu Tai, stealing my shot at glory. I didn't join Soldier to be an errand boy. I joined Soldier I joined to cause a genocide against Wu Tai. You. Hm. Well, our mission is to survey a rundown reactor. Another one of those Turks gigs. <sighs> Fine. Job's a job, I guess. Where is it? Nibelheim. Nibelheim? That's where I grew up. Got some fiends in our 12! Let's go. Your sword is impractical, Cloud. Just a couple of dragons. You take one, I'll take the other. Never mind, I'll take both. Come on, Cloud, you're being shown up. <laughs> Just give me a second. Coughing up my organs. Oh, I'm playing as Sephiroth. Hold still. Aerith!
He was in a different league from the rest of us. He also had those cat eyes. Nibelheim. That's where they built the first reactor. Right? Yeah. It all started in the fall. Something was wrong with the reactor, and the whole village was up in arms. Talk of strange new monsters on the mountain only made things worse. People were scared, desperate. I like that angle. The villagers tried to take care of the monsters themselves, but it was no good. They ended up calling Shinra. So the company sent help. Best they had. Welcome to Nibelheim. Home sweet home, right? Tell me, how does it feel? I have no home, so I wouldn't know. Uh, Explain it. Explain feeling parents, to me. Though, right? Stares into A your soul. Named Genova. She died shortly after I was born. My father. Oh, there. Genova? Like from the Shinra building? Yeah. Don't worry. I'm getting to that. Stop spoiling, Barrett. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Why am I talking about this? Come on. Let's go. Hope I didn't keep you waiting. I'm Xander, the mayor here. I wanted to greet you myself, to uh, welcome you to our humble little town. Please, if you'll follow me. Consider yourself off duty till sundown. I mean, it's already kind of dusk. Change it to performance mode. I'm noticing some stutter. Uh huh. <laughs> Zengen. The soldier. And you are? Richard Sanga, master of the fist. The humble traveler of the world and teacher of martial arts to the youth. Gucci, 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 Gucci. Well toned, but lacking mass. You need to bulk up. Agreed. Who asked you? You could learn a lot from me. Pass. Don't be shy. You kidding? Look at this I guy. Pupils your age. That last count. One hundred and twenty-eight. In fact, one of them's from this very village. I'd hope so if you're traveling here. Perhaps you know her. Tifa. Sure. Sure. A real talent, that one. She'll go far. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, right? You got anything to say for yourself? I didn't know. You could have at least embellished the story, you asshole. I'd be interested to see how one of Shinra's finest fights. Should you need my help, just say the word. You will always find a place at Zangen's Dungeon of Feasting. Ah, hello there. All our rooms are reserved for you, Shinra boy, so take your pick. You'll find them just up. Huh? No. Cloud? My, my, get a load of you, and you've only been away a couple of years. Yep. 
Traveling with the Sephiroth now? Okay, Mr. Big Shot. Traveling with the Sephiroth okay, we're good. now? Okay, Mr. Big Shot. Okay, Mr. Big Shot. Oh. You only got the room. City folk are so sophisticated. Can only imagine what their lives must be like. Let's see what this ladder hides. The old water tower. Three beds for four people, huh? Yeah, we're gonna snuggle up with Seth Dog. So how did it feel being back up there? Huh. My dad died when I was a kid. So after I left for Midgar, she was on her own. It was the first time we'd seen each other in two years. Our reasons. Oh, chocolate 9K. Thank you for the 100 bitties. <laughs> Our reasons, huh? They After finishing the OG, you watched you. FF7MA. Every episode were hilarious. Hell yeah, glad you enjoyed it, dude. I just let myself in. Remember my cat? Her name was Fluffy, I think. Where's Fluffy? Yeah. Can I pet Fluffy? She was always disappearing. And that day was no different. Oh. Nice cat tree you got there, though. It's a good cat tree. You went in my room, you fucking creep? Oh, this isn't her room. That's a big fucking phone. You stole my stuff? She have two double beds in her room. You went into my room? Oh no, this is her room. Why does her mom have two double beds? Do her parents have like a Brady bunch? Of Why is her room the bigger room? You went through my stuff? Yup. I know I shouldn't have. You asshole! Don't worry about it. Did you actually play it? I sure as fuck tried. That's called jazz. You could have just left it alone, you know. Yeah. What were you even thinking? I was yeah, thinking uh, of making a masterpiece. What if I actually played something good? Would they have been like nicer about it? I like her Moogle. And then I went through your stuff again. Oh, here off duty. Isn't that nice? Do you have like eyes in the back of your head? Ever since we heard a survey team was coming, we've been working our fingers to the bone. <gasps> cats! This is where the cats hang out. I figured out where your cat hangs out, Tifa. 
Who'd you call on the jelly rolls? Thank you for the 66 months. Happy anniversary to you. You worked out with everyone? Just for a bit. Could you keep up? Can I? All right, then. Let's get started. And where better to begin than with pose one? The Seraph. Are you ready? Am I ready? Can I actually do this? Lift your arms straight up and reach for the sky. Press your arms to your ears and show me your palms. I'm not Keep doing it. Fingers straight all the way to their tips. It's not even letting me. Rude. I wonder if I can knock off for lunch yet. Jesus fuck! just wasn't himself. Look at all those people. They're like ants. What are you looking at? Filth. This landscape. Huh? I could swear I've seen it before. You okay? Big day tomorrow. We'll be leaving bright and early. You should get some rest. All right, we'll do. Night. We're going to be sleeping in the same room, so this is an awkward goodbye. Unless I sleep at my mom's, which would I make tried, sense. But I couldn't get to sleep that night. I was too excited, too nervous. It was pretty much the same for me. Why? <laughs> yeah, I was surprised too. You know what happened the last time she went up there. That was years ago, Brian. She's old enough to make her own decisions now. Sorry, I slept in. We leave once our guide arrives. Yes, sir. Uh, Brian! Sephiroth, sir, <sighs> I must insist that I take you up the mountain. My daughter isn't- Dad! Tifa. Yeehaw! You can still back out. You don't have to do this. I'm going and that's that. There'll be More snacks than you for the 60 months. Me. I'll be fine. Pumpkin. Good morning, sir. I'll be your guide for the day. Tifa? Giddy up. You're our guide? I sure am. You can ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. You could get hurt. Not if you remember to do your job, she won't. Come on. For a posterity, sir? You have a nice ass. To us, it's just one photo. Come on, where's the harm in that? I don't like flashing lights, it sets me off. <sighs> there, <sighs> thanks. Say cheese. This will be 50 gil. It sounds like you were having a good time. One more, yeah. I guess we were Later. for a while. The reactor was halfway up Mount Nebel. I was looking forward to breathing that crisp, clean mountain air again. Boxes. Whoops. But when do I get to change to Tifa?
You probably already know this, but our reactor's the first of its kind. It really puts a needle on the map. I've seen a few reactors in my time, but none with such a breathtaking view. Who could tire of it? Everyone, eventually. Man, I wish I could go on trips all over the world like you guys. <laughs> trips? I think you mean business trips, which are no fun at all. I think Though you mean you missions. Stuff on them. That's so cool. Whoa, she parkoured me. I'm into that shit. Everything okay? Not going too fast for you, am I? Of course not. We're just trying to pace ourselves, is all. But, but I thought you guys were in a hurry. Even so, you'll burn yourself out running like that. I'm not even close to burned out. Not with all the training I've had. <laughs> Yes, you really are the best there is. Boxes. Hey, a monster. Ooh, it's all wriggly. Goopy. Seen those near the village, and they're not nice. What do you think? I think I got this. Then they're all yours. I, I was hoping you'd help. Bum, 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 bum. Punisher mode. Let's finish this. Gotcha. Operator mode. Your eyes. I got this. That was awesome. You think? If this is how it's going to be, there doesn't seem much point in me fighting. I guess not. You leave it all to me, huh? Yes, you need the experience points. Don't mind if I do. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Hostiles. Shut up. Braver! You're done. Piece of cake. I can lead the way now. Oh, she's faster. Is that Mako? Mmm, yummy, yummy, Mako. Kaka! Yeah, best girl. <laughs> Come on, soldier. You can do better than that, can't you? Just you watch. Idiot. How about a triple slash, huh? <laughs> Fucking fool! Well, that's that. Oh, 
yours. Whoa, what the fuck was that dash? You're done. See ya. Fool. Let's finish this. Get brave. Hey, it's the cloud one. Well done, Trooper. Damn it, Ramirez. No problem. I got the rest. Very rude. Fight's not over yet. There we go. No, you don't. Somebody's. Oh, I don't even have my soldier bolt. This ends here. Break it down. Put it in it. Put it in it. Put it in it. Put it in it. Brace yourself. Get smushed. We still have a long way to go. Shall we pick up the pace? Not unless we absolutely have to. Our guide might not be so lucky next time. Then. How about I go on ahead and clear the way for you guys? An inclusive tutorial? Careful. An inclusive tutorial would teach me through gameplay, not by boop, boop, menu. You'd better. Cool. See you at the reactor. Anything that pops up like that is an obtrusive tutorial. No. I refuse. DOES IT ANYWAY! FUCKING DOES IT ANYWAY! Hey guys. Alright, is there a way just to turn that shit off? There must be. Problem is, what happens if they come up with like a, a mechanic that I haven't heard? Let's finish this. I gotta say, that one felt pretty good. Square Enix is just so bad about that. Hey guys.
fuck? Pick up the thing, Cloud. There. Jesus. That's another materia, which I can equip by going to the materia menu. I want to go that way. It's a dead end. Rockslide took out the bridge a while ago. Come on back, okay? Okay. Make sure to explore your surroundings. You'd have led us straight off a cliff. Yep. Lead on. Yes. Yes. I'm so angry. I'm not the guide anymore. I'm in. Okay, see, the lights are just kind of failing. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Level boost materia. I didn't even wait for everybody to get on. that thing okay what what it's a screamer Sorry to leave you out in the cold. The reactor may have been around for a while, but there are still pockets of Mako gas all over the mountain. Try not to breathe it in if you can. Don't want to get Mako poisoning. Showing off Ramirez. See, I can jump barriers too. Or 
Snox, thank you for the 60 months. Free order for the game got uh, got canceled today. Oof. How's that even happen? Not sure what I'm doing with you, but uh, we'll figure that out in a minute, I guess. somewhere with this. Ah, ah, okay, it sucks up the Mako. Oh, this thing's got a long cord. Watch the cord, nobody trip. could have landed a helicopter up here. I mean, I guess there's a lot of flying enemies, but come on. I was I've been playing Death Stranding so much the rain just gave me like fucking PTSD. Just thinking about crossing that thing. Then let me go first. Hey, I'm the guide here. I mean, this seems like a pretty secure bridge. Well, until Rama decides to fuck us up. Sephiroth just holding on with one hand. Ugh, how inconvenient. I'm gonna kill the water! Oh, it was waist deep! Meh. Stand up! Bye, other guy. We lost Kowalski. in fate's hands now. Do you know the way? Yeah. Following the river should get us back to the village. We're not going to the village. Can you get us to the reactor? 
sorry. I. That's still I the mission. I, can. I see. Well, we certainly can't well, send you that's back too alone. Bad. You'll be safer with us. Okay. I'll be joining you up front this time. What? For your performance review. You kidding me? Good luck. Sephiroth joined the party! <sighs> you know how easy it would have been just to, like, you didn't need that prompt. Who needs that prompt? I'm just using the analog stick. It's desynced? God fucking damn it. Take a breather. Is it still desynced? Oh man, Sephiroth's got that good shit. I'm playing as Sephiroth? I got this. Now. It's on it. Sephiroth. Take the lead. I'd do that if I could play as Tifa right now, but... Uh, more Mako gas ahead. There's no way around it either. We just have to go through. <coughs> Let's not waste any time. Mako this stick is dangerous. <coughs> Steady. Sephiroth indeed. Oh, Sephiroth fights like Noctis. Let's hurry. Still major desync? Really? <laughs> My camera is desynced. My camera? One, two. A Mako spring. It's beautiful. <sighs> yeah, but if we keep using Mako to power our homes, springs like this will disappear, right? What are you talking about? Who told you that? My dad. And the mayor, if you must know. Except the planet's huge. Mako will never run out, right? Naturally formed materia. And look at the size of it. Astounding. For the Mako energy to condense into something like this, 
It must have taken an eternity. I've always wondered, how does Materia let you cast spells exactly? <laughs> how did you ever get to be a soldier? Hmm? To put it simply, the knowledge of the ancients is sealed within each orb. That knowledge not only connects us to the planet, it allows us to tap into her power. That's how we can use magic. Or so they say. Really? Magic sure is weird. <laughs> <laughs> I know someone who'd be livid to hear you call it weird. Or magic, for that matter. I can just imagine what he'd say. It's an affront to science. Who? Is that better? Hojo, from research and development. His predecessor was a great man, but him... He is anything but. <laughs> Alright, thanks. We Sorry about that. I, these technical issues are fucking killing me, man. I'm not sure if it's an OB... It must be an OBS thing. I get that it's not my fault and that it happens, and some of you are understanding, although when they do happen, they, it seems to, like, kill viewership sometimes. I don't know. I try not to stay focused on things like that, appreciate the people that hang around and stick around with me, but... It sucks when you notice that numbers go down. Dig me? Always nice to see number go up. Not fun to see when number go down. This way. Pretty. a nice view. Heads up. Yeah? Let's try a little thunder. See what's down here. I don't even know if I get to keep these items that I'm going for. Logically, it would not make sense to be able to keep them. Oh, I guess they can all teleport. like an arena. Again. There it is. It's the zoo. While guarding an R1, you can team up with allies to perform various synergy skills. Gotcha. Come on. 
Uh, I dude, I've done that a million times, all right? What fucking move, Sephiroth? Jesus. If I've already used and done the mechanic, you can't just do that. That's that. Mega Potion supposed to be that it heals everyone? I mean, at least that's old Final Fantasy logic, right? If it's a fight you want... So long. Hey, that one felt pretty good. Yeah, destroying those two tiny bugs. Talks that might try to do something like this with Chrono Trigger. I wouldn't be too shocked. Like, if it's any other RPG they have that's popular enough for some sort of treatment like this, it would be Chrono Trigger. That's a lot of boxes. Make this thing so miserably slow to push. Also, gas levels reduced by twenty percent. See if our pull strengths any better. Okay, are you telling me that now the uh... have I driven a floor, floor cleaning machine before? No, but I'm also not playing floor, floor cleaning simulator. You dig? Oh, you better believe I'm gonna Zamboni the shit out of that, Mako. Oh, it's gonna be so clean. Gonna purify the shit out of that air. Elevator 
Elevator access granted. Ah, that was necessary. Let's have a nice sit down. That was nice. Hold on, my eyes are adjusting. There we go. Up ahead, looks like a way out. Looks like a boss arena to me. Yeah, it was a boss arena. Get back. This way. <laughs> you said you wanted to be a hero. Wish I hadn't. It thinks we're after material. Someone should tell it we're not. Be my guest. Dragoon. I won't let you try to do that for you. You gotta keep your guard up. Try to mix it up. You need to bury your attack. Try to keep your guard up. Oh, Seth Dog! We're friends. Pretty mobile. Till we knock it down. Good thing I don't just fight with a sword. Staggered. I'm all that time to kick it up and It's all you. Winning. Phase three. You're practically panting. I'm excited. Such a puppy. 
Who's a little puppy? Use double helix synergy. Don't like the looks of this. Stay alert. Whoa. Damn it. Not again. Get it together. Ah, oh, you moved, you little bitch. Can't go near the Mako. Time for a limit break. Octa Slash! That's pretty good. Got him. Take it from here. Nice work. <laughs> okay, hold up. Maybe I'm missing something here. But everything you've said makes Sephiroth sound like a stand-up guy. Yeah, it was pretty cool until he snapped. Well, he was. And now he's pure evil, trying to kill everyone on the planet. Help me to understand this shit. Tell me something that'll really make my blood boil. Well, we'll get there. Oh, I will. I will. civilians even if we weren't on a mission come on keep the young lady safe okay carry on oh. would you like some iced tea ma'am he has a billy club you better keep me safe i will wanted to see the reactor. Didn't expect it to be all systems go. You'd think it'd be running at reduced output, like most last-gen models. And let me guess, pillagers don't have a clue about this. Knowing Shinra? Of course not. The company really needs to be more transparent. Tell that to the president. What exactly is the problem with this place? The people in charge. Hey, what's up, White Hat? While most reactors are under the jurisdiction of urban planning, this one is overseen by R&D. Huh. Why do I suddenly have a bad feeling about this? Whatever you see here, you are not to speak of it. Oh, I won't. Looks like somebody broke in here. Perhaps you'd 
like to say a few words to your sword first? Do I do I need to talk to my sword? Does it does it understand me? Genova? Oh, hey, that's your mama's name. Wasn't that... Go shut off the valve! You will believe a man can turn a spigot. <laughs> hey, Seth Dog, what you up to? Doing something cool? What are you doing? Stuff. These pods were built for the production of artificial materia. But Hojo repurposed them as incubators. Oh Lord Archive, I think it was 50 months, man. Happy <laughs> anniversary. With Mako. All to birth a new breed of monster. Cool. But he didn't stop at animals. Oh no. There were other subjects. Look. Devil man. My mother's name was Genova. Could it be that I was created the same way? Am I the same as these monsters? Sephiroth. I mean, you look way cooler. Your Ever complexion is way child, better, too. I knew. I knew that I was different, that I was special, but not like this. Not like this. Aerith. Eventually, we went back to the inn. But when we got there, Sephiroth locked himself in his room. The mayor had been looking forward to having dinner with bona fide soldiers, 
So he didn't take the news too well. Dad had to put up with his belly aching for hours afterward. Huh? Hmm? Must have uh -huh. sucked. But what about Sephiroth? What happened to him? He left. Didn't tell a soul where he was going. Sephiroth has left the party. Party is in wind down mode. I met Sephiroth as he was heading for Shinra Manor, and he acted like I wasn't even there. Busy, I suppose. I'm not going to regard him either. He's holed up inside the mansion. Something's been off ever since he came back from the reactor. Too much ex. Was news to me too. Doubt anyone in the village had a clue. Pretty sick place, pretty sick place. Nice. Excavated from a 2,000 year old rock layer. In life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova MEGL 77-1977. Genova verified as an ancient uh, MEGL 913-1977. Genova project approved. Mu Epsilon Gamma Lambda. So they named the life form Genova. It's not even technically Lambda. And once they understood what she was, they grew ambitious. Hey, Sephiroth. How's it going? What you got there? Leave me be. Uh, I'd rather not. And that was it. He stayed holed up in the basement. Reading, reading, like a man possessed. He survived on rats. Hmm. Night of the seventh you day. Enough. You could just say the seventh night. A locked reactor door, the name of Sephiroth's mother, and an ancient's. Ah, screw it. Racking my brain's not gonna get me anywhere. May as well just ask the guy. I should bring my sword just in case. the most fascinating passage. The specimen found in strata dating back 2,000 years smiled with what could only be described as ethereal grace. Though uh -huh. the truth eluded me at first, I later determined that she was an ancient or a steward of the planet as they are referred to in legend. She needed a name and so I dubbed her Genova. Cool. The Genova project was approved soon after. A bold initiative to resurrect 
the long dead ancients. An initiative that resulted in my conception. Cool. Or rather, my creation. The crowning glory of Professor Gas. Wondrous experiment. <coughs> he created you? Good there, bud. I should go. Mother is waiting. I'm going to see Mother. Oh, what was that flash? Hey! Hey, hold on! Okay, he's been holding back a bit, noted. Zengen's right, though. Cloud needs to beef up. Shouldn't be getting thrown like that. I keep asking myself, why couldn't I have come too sooner? Probably I the had. concussion. Maybe I could have saved the village. Or... Tried, at least. Ow. Uh oh. What? Nani? Hey, you! Get in there! The villagers need your help! What's Zengen doing? Why am I just walking? Nice move, Cloud. You really, you really, uh, really did a good job on that one. Mighty cloud fumbled by fucking. Oh no, don't push me back. It takes me forever to move an inch. I just got shoved out of the way by villagers. Oh, good. I got a spigot I can turn. Gotta turn that valve, crank it. Maybe it'll do something. Nope, just more wood. Hold on, I'm, I'm coming. I have to go around now, though. Don't worry. We're getting there. Oh boy, you better believe. Almost there, almost there. Limp a little faster, Cloud. You actually move faster while you're slow crouching. Maybe we should just stay slow crouching. Okay, no, back to the limp, gotcha. Oh, now you can fucking move! Please. Please be okay. 
Yeah, it's not exactly an alive amount of fire. Sorry, Cloud, you just don't love your mom enough. That Sephiroth sword. I like his Power Rangers belt. Hey, Seph Dog, what you doing, man? My murder. Yeah, they got shotguns. You sick son of a bitch. Let's burn up. Drop the sword. No, I just thought of something. Cloud, why don't you drink a potion or two? I have like a million of them. Maybe you shouldn't stand at like in sword range, guys. Why are you getting closer, you fucking twit? None of you have even taken a shot! Guys! Bro! Do they even have bullets? I'm beginning to think they don't have bullets. Not that they'd win anyway, but I mean... Yo, what's up, Stream 4 Star people? Welcome. Welcome to Nibelheim. Newly renovated. That's how you yell at the man who just murdered your whole village? There's the shot. Sephiroth! Bacon, lettuce, way, egg, and young. cheese. Dad and I had gone there to. Oh, Broad Spectre, thank you for the uh, sub. Welcome to the Lanham. or er, Board Spectre. Welcome to the Lanham Maniacs. Greatly appreciate the support. He was going to confront him. Dad. It was Sephiroth. Wasn't it? He did this, didn't he? <laughs> Sephiroth. Soldiers. Mako. Shinra. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this! <laughs> hey, Jesse, thank you for the raid, too. 
Welcome, everybody. Hope you're all having a good night. Oh, good, he left his sword behind. I just want to hear it go clang when she forgets to turn it to go through that door. Welcome. We're, we're here to see Mother. Mother, I have come for you. Now open the way for me. Now she'll neck got to be 30 pounds at least. 30 pounds isn't that much. You burned and it's Tifa. Dad. You burned my village. <laughs> and she's dragging it like Pyramid Head drags his heap of iron. <laughs> Whoa! Ow, 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 ow. That's a very shallow cut. on that all right let's uh now get angry uh Seth Seth Roth where'd you go bud oh there you are here I am, your son. Mother, together we will reclaim Love our everybody world. just quoting FF7MA. I know exactly how we can do that. The promised land. Sephiroth! <laughs> Mother, they have come again. The ones who robbed you of the planet. Your planet. But there's no need to be sad, Mother. Because I'm here for you. Now and forever. I'm your baby boy, Mommy. Yeah, I see the resemblance. You killed my mom. You killed Tifa. My village. My home. <laughs> they were mine by right. This planet too. For I have been chosen. Okay. I believed in you. Not you! Whoever the hell you are! Let's go. See how this see how this plays out. Then he just left, I guess. thing I remember. The rest is a blank. The hell it is? What happened? It was all over the news. I remember watching it with my mom. They said he went missing during a training exercise. 
But then... But what's bothering me is all this Genova stuff. Me this? Just had a feeling you'd know. Could they not get I under the actual blankets? Point. I guess that's not how the bed's modeled. All that stuff was taken from me, though. Or maybe erased? By whispers? Yeah. By Tetsuya Nomura. Maybe that's why. Why what? <laughs> this is gonna sound crazy, but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. Yeah, that is a really short blanket. And they just phased through it. Aw, oh, no avalanche snuggles. You up? I am now. Just in case. Can I scritch red behind the ears? No. Sorry. Did I wake you? Nope. What's going on? Oh, uh, it's nothing, really. There's just something I need to ask you. So, can we talk? Sure. Great, but not here. Follow me. Okay, then. Hey, what's up? I mean, the cut you left with her is really fucking shallow, bro. Do you think Midgar's... Over there? Anyway. There's something I need to ask you, too. Shoot. That night, five years ago, at the reactor, I saw you lying there. Saw your wound. Where's that smooth jazz coming from? Hell yeah. I thought we could just pick up where we left off, like nothing had changed. But I guess I was wrong. Guess so. I was so happy to see you again, but maybe I shouldn't have been. Oof! Ow! Best to leave them alone for now. I'm taking your bed. No. We have enough problems as it is. Copy. Night. Tomorrow is another day. Hey, he had a line. Yay, red. Never meet your heroes. Chapter two. A new journey begins. The 
last one up. All right, what's my equipment looking like right now? I got Chocobo and Moogle. Okay. Oh, a little gift box. What's this? A gift from our humble establishment. Though it may not look like much, it should help you to break the ice with those you meet. Queen's Weed. Blood. Oh. I see we've replaced uh, Fort Condor. I suppose. Each player takes turns placing cards on the board in one of three lanes that can span from left to right. First, try placing a card in one of the highlighted tiles adorned with an emerald pond. This music is slapping. Was this Gwent? This card is placed. His power is added to the uh, lane total. New positions will also be added to the board, which are tiles with emerald ponds. Yellow number in the top right corner of a card is its power. The positions a card will add to the board are indicated by the yellow squares in the graphic. Oh, okay. Next, place a card so that one of its yellow tiles overlaps with one of your existing positions. Okay. Oh, you want to play well, the other bird, fine. When your card's position tiles overlap to the position you control, the position raises its rank. These are two pawns tile rank. Two cards can only be placed in position. Oh, okay, I see. Now play a rank two card. Hiya! One of your card's position overlaps with one of your opponents. You claim that position as yours. Note, however, that claiming a position will not raise its rank. Crystalline Crab. What are you gonna do about it? Uh-oh. Plus two. Basically, I just soak up all of his positions, and then he can't do shit. Aha! There we are. My threefer.
All right, I think I win. Yeah, whatever. Can't do anything, so pass. As the game is over, each player's score is tabulated. Only the player with the higher power in lane has the power added to their score. Okay. And so you lose. All right, I basically mastered the game. I'm good. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the Sector 7 plate. Ah, oh, it's a rerun. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Inkeep. I must apologize for not introducing myself to you earlier. I'm Broden. Broden! Your companions have all stepped out. Oh, but Barrett left a message he wanted me to pass along to you. I recognize that you voice. Missed roll call, soldier boy. Luckily, you're on leave for the day. I think that's Mick. Don't waste it, though. Get your equipment checked ASAP. Sound advice. AKA Rice Pirate, AKA Android 13. Perhaps a trip to the arms dealer is in order? Good idea. By the way, Cloud, do you have any folios on you? Yeah. In that case, you might also want to pay a visit to Magnata Books. Magnata. It stores all over, but the first official one was built here in Calm. And their resident scholars are remarkably talented. If you want to unlock the true potential of your folios, you should go see them. The first customization is always free. Finally. Rough day yesterday, huh? You've been waiting for me? I've been waiting for a chance to thank you properly. No. Without your help, I'd still be in Hojo's clutches, trapped in that lab. It was nothing. Even so, I owe you a debt until it's paid. I'm going to accompany you. Yeah, good boy. Getting your equipment checked. Have them check mine while you're at it. I'm not up to date on my Should shots. Hmm. The Rick's got a backbone. Overcoming challenges. Helping people in need and exploring the world will deepen your party's bonds, thereby increasing your party level. The higher this level, the more skills and abilities will be available in your folios. Card game! <laughs> what do you want? Don't scare me like that! You... You don't want to play Queen's Blood, do you? I was hoping that... Oh, what am I thinking? You look like you'd murder me! Correct! Oh, God, this is too much! I think... I'm gonna throw up! <laughs> Give me that look! It's perfectly healthy for adults to cry too, you know! Not over card games. <laughs> Call me cry baby dead. I believe it. Because the more tears I shed, the better I get at Queen's Blood. <laughs> Please play around with me. I don't know that I want to. Ah, he'll give me his crystal crab. <gasps> A mute. It's time to da -da 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 duel. Oh, oh, oh. No, I can work with this.
What, I can't play that there? Why? I had. Oh, I need two pegs on that. Right, 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 right. I want to get that guy down there. I'm trying to figure out how to do that. I guess like this first? Damn, I don't know that I can. Whoops. Oh, wait, no, I can. Booyah! That would make his card stronger, though, wouldn't it? No, it doesn't. Okay, it only it only affects mine. Noted. Good. Anyway. Victory for Lanny. Take that crybaby Ned. Yo whiny little bitch. Give me your card, nerd. That guy's supposed There's to look like Mark Zuckerberg. Blood to relieve some stress. Speaking of, you look like you've got a lot weighing you down too. It's written all over your face. Trust me, crying does wonders. You really ought to try it. I win. Have you heard of Queen's Blood? All the kids at school are playing it. It's the newest sensation. Brian Kylegate. Yeah, it's true. Uh, oh, looky here. I'd say we got ourselves a contender. Okay. So how about it, pretty boy? You want to throw down? Bring it on, small child. Let me introduce you to Nene, Master Ventriloquist. Now she ain't much of a talker, but give her a deck of cards and she'll wipe the floor with you so fast. It'll make your head spin. Ready to get your ass handed to you? Whoa, you? language, young lady. Ooh, she'll give me a cactois. This deck is serving me pretty all right. Queen B is kind of eh, though. Need a wider board for Queen B to do anything. Whatever. Doesn't look like it lets me swap out cards right now.
see how I'm gonna get there. There it is. Hmm. Doesn't quite work, does it? I guess I could block him off a little. Could be worth it. So then he has the option of blocking me off. And I don't like that too much, none. He's got the bottom row. Wait, that instantly becomes his two pawns? Whatever. Get wrecked, putts. Dominated that small child. You're welcome. Thank you for playing cards with me, Mister. All right. I don't even know what my missions are here. Oh, hey, Earth. Uh huh. Yeah, I've just been playing cards with people. Yeah. So what you been doing? Why, waiting for you, of course. You maybe. Got business with the bookstore? If so, I won't keep you. But if you're free, climb the clock tower. Wanna uh, climb the clock tower together? Sure. Sure. Our That's relationship has changed. Real? Awesome. Since it was my idea, I'll go get the tickets. I'll meet you in front of the tower, okay? Books. Oh, I take it this is your first visit to one of our stores. Well, customization can seem tricky to the uninitiated. Uh -huh. It takes time and experience to get it right. Okay. But I think you'll pick it up quick enough. Spend Let's skill points try. at Magnata Books locations and auto mats to augment your party's folios, thus unlocking powers in late, uh, latent in your allies. Ugh. Oh. This is why I hate RPGs. The sphere grid.
Would you guys romance Tifa or Aerith? Tifa. That's all you're gonna teach. Okay. And that's about all we can do for now. But we haven't even skimmed the surface. Believe you me. There's much more to this than meets the eye. It may not seem like it yet. But okay, I will see. Excuse me. Excuse me. What the fuck am I doing? Oh shit. <laughs> what a glorious wall. Keeping us safe and secure. Excuse yeah, that's my me. bad. That was my barricade you just destroyed. Huh. Yeah, I just took a swim. To admire the Bailey? It is something. Or maybe. Maybe. You to get your ass handed to you in a QB match. <laughs> I'm Zahira. A pleasure. Just like Calm's wall, I yield to no one, refusing to give a single inch to my opponents. Don't presume you'll emerge unscathed if you decide to go up against me, because you will wind up with me. Audio desync webcam or game? You got to be specific, guys, because my entire thing is not being kind to me. Ah, she's got a screamer. Should be back now. Those two out. Oh, because I added. Gotcha. Too many. Hold on. Let's try that. Begin match. See you've played Knifey Spoony before. to be like right here is the problem.
There we go. Got him. Slap him down. Boom. Exodia. Wait. Oh, shit. That was a good move on their part. Like, I can't play any more cards. They just kind of... Wow. I can't do shit. Here, I thought I was being hot shit there. Rematch. Bitch. Let's see. I think I can get that back. I can get that back. Okay, I can play him later. Again. Correct. Well, guess we're done with that mini game. Damn. When I grow up, I'm gonna be a soldier. Right? This Mako tank allows us to live in comfort. <sighs> morning. Hi. Morning. Morning. Everyone's kind of off doing their own thing. I noticed. Say, uh, this tank remind you of anything? Yeah. Place I made that promise to you. You remember the dress I wore? It was one of my favorites. Uh, the light blue one? With a bit of green in there? Good <laughs> mind, Cloud. Didn't change your relationship that much, but you know what? Very heavy. Look of it. Impractical, really. Seeing that, it's still only a shadow of what it could be. With a little love, that baby will sing. If you like, I could show you. Adjust your weapon skills via upgrade weapons. Yeah, I can do that. 
I will skip that tutorial. See? what I tell you? That girl is singing, and she's got the voice of an angel. Just make sure you take proper care of her, all right? Oh, and while you're here, check out what we got to offer. Yeah, show me what you got. That's why I'm here. The Sleek Saber. Hunter Bangle. How much money do I have? I have 2,000 gil. Cushion. You take care of that weapon now. The Date with Aerith. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a Kingdom Hearts too. Should we get sea salt ice cream too? I mean, she's faster than me, but she's also not carrying like a fifty-pound slab of metal on her back. I don't know, probably 80 pound. I think Midgar's this away. Probably should even more. Be, yeah. You can still see the smoke from the explosions. Funny, isn't it? How small it looks. It is far away. So, did something happen between you and Tifa? We're roommates, you know. She say something? Her ponytail is you, stiff. No. Still, I can tell. I would have given anything to have a friend when I was growing up. Don't take her for granted. It's a fat ass plane. on the other guy's parachute kills both instantly. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. I'm just gonna go inside. Uh, there you are. Hey, Broden. Oh, there isn't much time. We need to get back to the end. What? Don't worry about your friends. They're safe, trust me. Broden no living up to his name. Please.
I mean, we stick out like a sore thumb. How are we not going to get spotted? Follow me. anybody with an oversized sword like that guy over there hey wait a minute I heard about the reactor bombings in Midgar. that was you wasn't it yes it's okay I'm on your side I got a contact at HQ Your Moogle cakes not exactly stop I'll keep the troopers occupied while we're talking you two go up and over what? May I ask what's going on? We're searching for some fugitives. Have you seen anyone suspicious? Now that you mention it, you got my doubt. Though perhaps it was just my imagination. Was it? Oh, come on. Get out of here. Wait, wait. I know I saw some people who had a Up and over. I love moving slowly for no reason. They have a helicopter. Their eyes in the sky aren't very good. No, but we're still searching buildings. We'll search harder. We gotta find them. I have to do the gorilla walk. Ooh. Rodent, friend. That went well. The end's not much further. But stay on your toes. Immediately, like lobby full of like soldiers. Transmuter. Converts raw materials into more practical items. A Republic antique, but it still works. You'll get more use out of it than me. Wu Tai. Why are you doing this? Could have just turned us in. I got bored. Who knows? Maybe this will turn out to be the worst decision I've ever made. So but if you have a smuggler's tunnel, you, I mean, use it, right? No. I refuse tutorials. I'm stubborn. Hey guys. Oh, you made it. All in one piece? Sorry, we're late. For the love of where the hell have you two been? Clock tower. On a date. Kind of. What? Uh. Well, that was the last one. At least till things calm down. Uh, 
Now, let's move. Go ahead, Barrett. Where to now? Where there's a draft. This way. <laughs> kind of the Looks only way, like really. Job for me. Good job, Barrett. Who's this a job for? Is it me? Hi, Red. Oh, I'm gonna hold that triangle. What good? Got like deer and shit. A living, breathing planet. Even after everything we've done to it, it's still going strong. I mean, it's trying. It may look that way, but in reality, it's barely hanging on. Guess I still have a lot to learn. What do you want to know? For starters, how do we cross these plains? On foot. Come on now, that's easy. The same way you get anywhere. Pick a direction and start walking. That's a cliff, Barrett. That's a cliff. Your left, your left, right. Yeah, I gotta wait to get my salty yes, run back on that card game, I suppose. Let's go. <laughs> and there it was! The first step on our new journey. You coming? Yeah. Of course we are. Nobody in this party has the same colored eyes. Just your battle party for combat. You can set mini markers. I wonder who's in my party by default. Me, Red, and Aerith. Well, that's changing. that everybody hangs around and it's not just the three that are in your party. summons in the throes of battle the entity slumbering within an equipped summoning materia may begin to stir prompting the summon gauge to appear 
Finish him off. Dive kick! Oh, I thought it was more of a dynamic entry. Nothing to it. The way she controls in combat feels different than before. Not sure how I feel about it. Maybe we just haven't unlocked the same shit, but I remember all like the chi traps and shit. It's a little weird that my destination is in front of me no matter which way I look. Gotcha. Explore the environment, you might find things. Oh, I can't switch out the leader? Boo! There was a bird there, right? I have to beat the game to switch out Cloud? Aww. Oh yeah, how does Red do that? Wow, look at him go. Looks a little silly. place I just left? Why is that my destination? Things. We're fine. How can you be so sure? Because I've read the field guide. Like any good soldier. Was she talking about the deer? Wildlife will only attack while on the hunt or in defense of their territory. Fiends, on the other hand, attack without reason. If they're attacking, what does it matter? It matters if your nose can discern their intent before they attack, as I gather yours can't. Hey, how does your nose do that, though? You'd be the avalanche, folks? Yes. It's okay, I'm on your side. Heard you be heading my way. You're safe here, but not for long. By the sound of it, Shinra's leaving no stone unturned. Might want to hole up at the old dock out by the swamp. I'd wait your Shinra's forgotten it's even there. <gasps> Dog. What are you? Ah, you're one of those. Let's head to that abandoned dock out by the swamp.
Oh, hey, what's up? Well, well. There's Choco Bill. If it ain't my favorite group of hitchhikers. Oh, fancy meeting you here. Thanks again for the right to call. Ah, uh, don't mention it. It's the least I could do for two such lovely young ladies. But I do believe I neglected to introduce myself. The name's Bill, and you can count on me for a lift anytime. Choco Bill. Except today, that is. Afraid the old butte's pulled up lame. Sorry about that. No biggie. We're enjoying the fresh air. Thanks, though. You, uh, know someplace we can hunker down? Hmm. Hunker down, you say? Oh. <laughs> I'd almost forgotten what it was like to be young and in love. <laughs> you will just head straight that away toward the swamplands. You'll find an abandoned building by the dock. I guarantee no one will bother you there. Ah, yes, the perfect love shack. The abandoned swamp shack. I appreciate that they just, you know, dive headfirst into the fact that this game's a dating sim. Chakra. There's dynamic entry. Wait, these are just squirrels. Shit, squirrel! Those squirrels never stood a chance. They must have been nuts to mess with us. Ah, yes. Lovely little place. I got it for free. That guy was selling it for 3k. What a dick.
increases the number of consecutive slashes with a strong attack in Punisher mode. Increases ATB recharge weight when performing actions by 10%. Percent boost at Chi level 1, 10% at Chi level 2. Yeah, that sounds useful. There we go. Welcome to the swamp lands. No sign of Shinra. Yeah. Looks like an old Republic landing. Could borrow a boat, make our way across. Then, head on through the mines and keep going till we hit Juna. Sure. Why not? You'd trust these rotting hulks? Lamp. I mean, we could. Let's not. Then maybe. We swim it. Shield Studio, thank you for the raid. Hope you had a good stream. Swamp is home to the deadly Midgard Swarmer. Beware. Uh, Midgard Swarmer? But even really? If you're slow. You can rent a chocobo. We'll see you safely past being nothing if not fast. Jormungandr? So give Bill the word, and he'll pick you out. A bird! <laughs> <laughs> well. Can we rent some birds? Can we? Uh, I, I'm nervous. Fine. I read a little. Gotcha. Press square and triangle like with everybody else. Okay, red's kind of cool. Stardust Ray! Jesus! Red kicks ass. Why does Cloud have the worst fighting style? I don't know, actually Barrett might be like
take the lead. Drive kick! Yeah, I still like playing as Tifa. The red's got something special. He's got that oomph. And he's a dog. I see your truck's working again. Pleasure to see you all again. And welcome to my humble ranch. Managed to get your truck fixed? Indeed I did. You must have been my lucky charms. She started up right after you left. Anywho, what can I do you for? You in the market for some fine feathered friends by any chance? Oh, look at them! Are we ever? Need them to get through the swamp lands. Then you have come to the right place. Back in the day, we had Republic fairies to get us from A to B. But now they're nothing but driftwood, sadly. We got the next best thing, though. Choke them both. To them, a bottomless bog's no worse than a kiddie pool. Now, ladies, you're probably wondering what gives these birds the power to glide across swamps with ease. Inbreeding. Uh... Would you believe that their fluffy feathers give them the buoyancy to float Aww. while their limber legs can outrun a motorboat? Not even the dreaded Midgard Sormer, one of the fastest fiends around, can keep up with them. Oh, wow. <laughs> but you don't need convincing. You just need pointing to a hard-working chocobo. Chocobo. Nature's two-legged limousine. So can we rent some? Sure can. My grandson Billy's in the stable over yonder. He'll help you out. Choco Bill and Choco Billy. Fluffy Chocobo. Can I pet the Chocobo? Chocobo don't want to get no pets. Howdy! Saw the sign. Need some Chocobos to cross the swamp. I'm sorry, Pops, but you're out of luck. Pops. Oh, I'm so Pops. old. Last one went this morning. Could have fooled me, kid. These are spoken for. That or they're not fit for riding. Oh. But I can see you're in a bind, so I'll bump you up the list. For a price, of course. Which is? Ten grand each. <laughs> I ain't got that. Is, we don't have that kind of money. Or any, really. Hmm. Well, there is one other option. Only cost you a grand. Uh. Is what a scoundrel might say. But I wouldn't dream of distressing y'all further. Just so happens one of our birds ran off the other day. Wild thing, but still a fine chocobo. If you can manage to find and catch him, then he's yours. Free of charge. You sure? Yeah, why not? Name's Pico. The hardest headed bird you'll ever meet. By far. But we can't all ride one chocobo. And he's the spitting image of Pops here. <laughs> you can start by looking for his tracks. Find those, and you're sure to find the feet that made him. Now, wild chocobos can be a bit skittish around people. But if you play it cool and creep up real quiet-like, you'll wrangle him no problem. I think we can do that. Thanks. And one last thing. This info comes free of charge, provided you promise to stop by our shop. Speak to Chloe back there. She'll sell you whatever you need. <laughs> Choke Chloe. Kids are born businessmen. <laughs> if y'all can catch our runaway and get his butt back here, riding and rearing lessons are on me. Sorry about my brother. All he thinks about is money. He's just doing his job. We understand. Gotta his keep bones, the farm going. He's been a real pain about it ever since our parents... Left. Say, are you guys from Midgar? Yeah, the Undercity. 
Then, do you happen to know Chocobo Sam? Um, not very well, but... Yeah, I guess we do. Where is he? Probably the Sector 6 slums. He's a big deal in Wall... Um, why do you ask? I was thinking about reaching out. It's his fault Mom and Dad are gone. What a bastard. So... Chloe, that's none of these good folks' business. But they could help. Don't tell anyone what she told you. Sam's one of the biggest names in the business. If he gets wind of that story, our ranch is done for. Don't worry, your secret's safe with us. I promise. Oh! Those are some fresh-ass peppers. You can give them to Pico when you find him. They were always his favorite treat, you see. Maybe he'll come back once he's had a taste. Right. Should probably sell you stuff, huh? Billy will throw a fit if I don't at least try to get you to spend a few gil. No pressure, but if anything catches your eye. Also, if you have any golden plumes on you, I can exchange them for chocobo gear. So be sure to hand them over if you do. Okay. What you got? What are you selling? I see. You sell bits and pieces. Alright, let's go find Pico. Alright, Pico. Where'd you run off to? You mean Pico? Let's try looking for some traps. Keep the greens away from red. Do my best. Follow the chocobo tracks. Ah, there they are. My brain's so used to having detective vision to make something like that highlight that my eyes are having trouble keeping track of it. Modern gaming has weakened me. Oh, there it is. Bingo. Yeah! Come on, y'all. Let's go bag us a chocobo. Chocobo. That one is a saddle already. Must be Pico. Keep it down. When you're on the hunt, you don't want to startle your prey. Prey? He says clanking you know we're about. You to kill him, right? Yeah. He's still our target. This isn't even the one I'm supposed to go for, but... Look that way. Quee! Quee! Got you now, bitch. Got you! Woo! Oh, oh. Good bird. Runs away immediately. Here, have a beet. Or a radish. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Quill! Isn't he just the cutest? <laughs> you know, 
They are kind of similar. Totally. <laughs> uh. What does he want now? Do you think maybe he's still hungry? Sorry, that's all the food we had. Wow. But you know where there's more? Bill's place. <laughs> and he's gone. Back to the ranch it is then. Come on. What's a bizarre warble though? Warp, 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 warp. Welcome to Bill's Ranch. I did it. There's our guy. <laughs> Nothing beats a little taste of home, now does it? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Not so much as a feather out of place. We got one healthy bird here. Enough to ride. Sure. Though I wouldn't try till he's done eating. Once he's at his fill, though, I'm sure he'll come around to the idea if we ask him nice. Ain't that right? I'll need to prep his gear and all that. So why don't you wait outside? I can do that. Ah, Chadley! Hey there. What a pleasant surprise. You do remember me, don't you? I do, you creepy little bitch. I knew you would. It was an absolute pleasure working with you in Midgar. Thank you again. Your invaluable intel allowed me to create so much materia. Detecting internal monologue. The hell's this weirdo doing here? <laughs> I was created by Professor Hojo, you know. Though your that thoughts makes could sense. be read by any cyborg. But, to answer your question, I took a page out of your book and skipped town. Now, the whole world's my laboratory. Speaking of which, I have a favor oh to God, ask. he's out here breeding things. Trouble. You need more battle intel. That's the cloud I know. Always eager to get on with it. But yes, though, I'd like you to activate some Remna Wave Towers first. They were originally constructed by the Republic of Junon, but were claimed by Shinra after the war. Since which time they've sat idle and untouched, just waiting for someone to put them to good use. The more towers you activate around the world, the more my processing power will grow. And then I'll so rule the whole thing. Surface, I'll kill Sephiroth himself and dethrone God. Construct a communications network independent of Shinra. How does that sound? You'd not only be helping me, but yourselves as well. We find him. We'll turn him on. Wonderful. I thought you might say something like that. Let's get started then. See that tower? That's your first target. Can you not do it? Okay, whatever. And it's like right there. Activate it. Oh. I mean, you already had the thing that you needed. As the tower's I close by, the Chad module. How's he a cyborg? He probably just doesn't show all his robot bits. I mean, that thing sticking on his face is clearly not organic. Here we are. Entering Chad module.
Power activation confirmed. Initiating preliminary scan of the grasslands. I'll ascertain the locations of fiends and natural resources. Gotcha, they're just... Okay. They're map markers. After careful consideration, I have devised a new name for this type of research. I call it World Intel. Worked really hard on that one, huh? Feel like that was a first draft. I hope you'll assist me in gathering relevant data by completing various tasks on your travels. In return, I will use the information you provide to develop new materia, quid pro quo. To summarize, I want us to become research partners. But before that, is there anything you would like to ask? No. In that case, I see no reason not to begin at once. With your activation of this tower, my analysis of the grasslands has already yielded some data. Though hardly substantial, it is enough for me to create materia. Which of these would you like? Allows you to turn enemies into items and morph enemies whose health has fallen below a certain amount can be defeated in this fashion. Okay, that's neat. This is the ability that breaks Final Fantasy VIII. Oh, use fire and blizzard. That's nice. I wish you all the best in the long journey that lies ahead of you. And remember, you're not in this alone. Should you require assistance, just ask. He's got a Roomba. I have recreated Titan, the mythical colossus of the grasslands, in virtual space. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. You got it. All right. Put on my VR goggles. I'll fight Titan. Oh, Jesus. Fuck it, give it to me. I probably need a healer. Fucking go, you fucking nerd. Okay. I'm noticing a bit of an issue here. Oh god! Cloud's dead. Holy shit, that's a lot of damage. Fucking... What? Wait, seriously? It's okay, Aerith, you got this. Okay, you did not have this. Okay, yeah, okay. Might need to uh, work on that a little bit there in order to beat Titan. Challenge failed? Yeah, you know. Feel like dealing one damage at a time, probably an issue in that regard. Uh, fuck it. 
Fuck you, Chadley. Okay. Looks like there's a lot of things on here to try out. Analyzing one's failures can prove instructive. Yes, it can. Thank you, Chadley. I wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. I'll probably do a lot of Chadley stuff off stream. Speaking of off stream, I had a late night last night finishing up uh, Death Stranding. And an early morning this morning. And another early morning tomorrow morning. So I'm going to peace out for now, but I should be on more tomorrow with some more Final Fantasy 7 2 if you want to hang out with me. Peace out for now, though. I will be on later. Have a good one, everybody. Night.